Epstein, huh? Juan Luis Pedro Filippo de Huevos Epstein. <laughs> from San Juan. Your mother's Puerto Rican? No, my father. <laughs> my mother's name is Bibberman. <laughs> No, no. The, actually, the idea for Welcome Back Cover, true story. Uh, and true story, by the way, of Eric Cohen. Now, Eric was one of the producers of Cotter and one of the creators of Cotter. And as the story goes, uh, Gabe, when he was just beginning to take off as a stand-up comic, uh, went over to the Ice House to see Eric's act. Now, Eric at the time was writing for Carson, was the head writer for Carson, was like 23 years old and saw Eric's act, which was essentially about these characters that he went to school with. And Gabe, being an upstanding man, bought the act. You know, most comics go there and steal the act. G Gabe went there, wrote a check, and then hired Eric to continue to write for him. And obviously, you know, Gabe took it up another level because uh, he's a wonderful performer, and there you go. Uh, it, that went on to become a television series. Yeah, they were originally going to call it Cotter. And then John Sebastian, who was a friend of Alan Sachs, who was the producer at the time, uh, gave this idea to John, and John came back. And actually, I, I, when he got in the mail, he opened and said, here, listen to this, listen to this. And you hear Sebastian just on a little cassette going, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. and. From there, it took off. That became the title. Wow. Yeah. And it also tells the whole story of the show, doesn't it? Yeah. The, the premise for the show. Yeah, and, and, and what Alan did is he went back to Brooklyn with a handheld camera and photographed all the streets. The kid on the tricycle, not to be believed. The kid on the tricycle at the end of the credits found me one day in New York. Sorry. The kid who was on the tricycle in New York found me one day in New York. Now, I, I'm a gullible guy, but he described Alan on a steady cam, in a, uh, not on a steady cam, just in a handheld, driving in a car. And I said, oh yeah, you're the guy. So yeah, and that talk about irony. Yeah.